What is up, Go High Level users? Uh, this is Ross from Lee here, and I'm going to show you our new Go High Level integration. Now, you are actually staring at a Go High Level account. It doesn't look like it because we've done so many modifications to the CSS, but just imagine this in your same exact account where you have uh, leads on the left or your menu bar on the left side, etc. Now, our scraper allows you to pull data and push it directly into a campaign or into a CRM without having to do anything else. So just to give you an example here, I have a campaign here. I have this redial template. This would be for my cold callers. You could do a, a campaign for email, whatever you want. And, um, and you can also push them into a pipeline. Now I've also got set up here a trigger to add anyone who hits this demo with the lead in that they go into the pipeline. So since we have a trigger and we have a campaign, let's go get some leads. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'll click on this and let's just type in here, uh, chiropractor, and I'm gonna do a small town here. Let's do West Bend, Wisconsin. Um, I used to live in West Bend and my guess is that there's probably like 10 people there. You can do searches like Milwaukee uh, 28. Um, Houston and you're gonna get hundreds thousands in Houston I think there's like 1200 of them so you can get a lot but just for this example we're just gonna do a small amount um, so I'll go ahead and I'm gonna select all these and I'll push these into the CRM and when I click here I could either do all tags or I can click demo I'm gonna go ahead and do that push that let that run in the background and um, and then let's go check and see uh, how that worked out. Now I'm going to look on my phone. I know that there's supposed to be a little circle carrot that will be there within like the next hour to let you know that it's completely finished pushing over any deals. But for the meantime, let's just go ahead and check this out. Click on this. Okay, so we got a bunch of leads that have pushed over into here. Now let's go check out our... Um, our manual actions and now look at this we got all these different numbers in here that we can call we've got some from earlier from uh, Germantown but then we also have our West Bend ones in here as well um, let me just show you a little bit more about the scraper and how this uh, integrates with your platform it's really really easy uh, when you get into lead carrot and you sign up you're actually gonna log in and you're gonna see this exact CRM just like this um, it's styled just like this when you get into your account. If you've already got a Go High Level account, though, you do not have to use ours. It's just something that we include the one account when you sign up. Uh, and you go over to click on Lead Carrot, and you click on these three little sandwich bars over here, and you're going to click on Integrations. Now, over here, what you're going to do is you're going to click on this, and it's going to take you to your agency view this we got to fix our styling on this for our agency view but anyways it's going to take you to the agency view you're going to copy your api key and you're going to come back and you're going to paste it right here once you do that all you have to do is copy this menu copy this menu link and hit save and now all you have to do is go over here into custom menu links add a custom menu link and you paste that uh, URL right here. You want to make sure you paste it exactly the same and that you have it as open iframe inside because what that does is that's actually going to push your API key over into um, uh, it'll pass it through the iframe so that we don't have to keep logging in. So then what will happen is you'll go into your Go High Level account you'll see um, your lead carrot um, menu item and when you click on it the first time you might have to log in but after that it's always going to pass through your API key and you're no longer going to need to keep doing that if you don't know where to find your API key it's in your agency settings uh, you can just click that little button right here and it'll take you to it hopefully that makes sense um, and if you guys have any questions just message us in the little chat box on the right side